Hey you guys, so in this video I'm going to be showing you guys how to get this cute little flexi rod set. This flexi rod set, it is really, I really have a love-hate relationship for it right now. At first when I was taking out the set, I didn't really like it. But now that it's set in and it's later on in the day, um, it's still day one here, but I, I'm, I'm, I'm digging it. I'm liking it. I'm feeling it. it I think it's cute. I like it, but I have a love-hate relationship with it. And even right now, I'm sort of like, mm, but then I'm also like, yeah, but I'm also like, mm. So if you'd like to see how I got this flexi rod set, definitely um, stay tuned in this video. Thank you for clicking. In my previous video in the skincare routine, I did state that I want to venture off into other things like beauty. So this is going to be a hair tutorial. Of course, I'm going to continue doing the readings. This isn't how I normally do my flexi rods. I do it a completely different way, but I didn't want to put heat to my hair. I already bleached my hair. I already dyed my hair, which I'll explain more about it in this video. So my hair is about, I would say 80, 85% dry. Um, I don't want it to be super soaking wet. I was going to blow dry it, but then I decided last minute I don't want to blow dry it. Um, I bleached my hair yesterday and then I dyed it today. So I don't want to put my hair through more than it already has been through. We're going to divide this. I'm going to divide it off. So now you have this section and then you're going to divide this section off so you're gonna do it into two the product that I'm gonna use is ion smooth solutions it prevents frizz provides heat protection enhances shine so I started using this because like I said I was gonna blow dry my hair but then I decided not to last minute so I did two pumps and I'm gonna work it through my hair especially through the ends then I am going to detangle it with a wide tooth comb and this is almost done, but this is what I've been using. The Lotta Body uh, Wrap Me Foaming Mousse. You can use literally any foaming mousse. But I'm going to put this mainly on my ends, you guys. Mainly on the ends. Because the ends, you really want to make sure that it sets in whatever curl pattern that you want it to be. Because the top is more easier to manipulate. The top and middle is more easier to manipulate. But them ends... And considering I bleach my things and, you know, it's going to be a little bit harder to manipulate. It's going to be a little bit harder to hold the curl. So you want to make sure that you have, you know, extra product on your ends. And then I'm going to use a smaller tooth comb and I'm going to work that through. And then I'm going to do a twist as if I'm doing the twist out. I'm going to wet them. You see how dry these things is? So you want to make sure that the end is super drenched, super drenched. And you're going to continue twisting. You're going to get your flexi rod and then you're going to do the end first. And you're going to make sure the end is really secure. Like it's not going to move. Let me look on the camera real quick. I mean in the mirror. And then you're going to roll it. And you want to keep making sure that the end is good. Okay. And boom. To the next section. So now with this. I'm gonna split it down in the middle. You can see my roots is a little orange. It's a little orange. Alrighty. So yeah, you guys. So I definitely want to start getting into more content. Um, I definitely want to venture off onto other things. I'm not gonna stop readings at all. That's not the case. That is my full-time job. It's going to stay my full-time job and I'm going to continue doing readings. But I do want to venture off to other things. Hair, makeup, um, even ASMR. I have an ASMR channel that is linked in the description box. But I barely even post on there. And it's because I'm super hyper. Like, y'all can't tell from the readings. Because I want to be professional. But I'm hyper as fuck. So it's like, imagine being super hyper and then you got to... Like, I'm too hyper for all that. Hi. I'm way too hyper. Way too freaking hyper. So, yeah, I do want to do some ASMR or like mukbangs and stuff like that. I do want to do like product reviews as well. Speaking of product reviews, I will be uploading a video soon enough of a product review from um, Heavenly Nature. Heavenly Nature. This is the turmeric butter. 
And then I have the turmeric scrub. I've been using it on my face, you guys, and I absolutely love it. And I, I'm going to do the review. Look out for the review. These products are amazing. And this isn't my first time um, having some of her products. I have bought, I met her at a pop-up shop, actually, um, in Bridgeport, Connecticut, at Mango's for my people that, you know, if you know, you know. And I have met her and I told her, you know, I got a channel and this, this and that, whatever, whatever. And I have bought some face products. And it was so amazing. I actually did a review on that as well. Um, I may comment it down below if you guys would like to check it out. But I'm so, like, amazed by her product. Okay, and then you are going to spray. I might stop using it because... I'm trying to get as much as I could. You see that? I know some left. Shoot. I'm the type of person, I don't like to waste nothing. I'm not a waster type of person. I don't like to waste food. I don't like to waste groceries. I don't like to waste nothing because there's people out there that don't have the ability to waste not a damn thing. There's people out there that don't have anything to waste. And here I am wasting stuff. So, yeah. Wrap. Wrap, wrap, wrap. And wrap. And you can also do this without doing the twist. You can do this, um, you know, by detangling it, adding your product, and then twisting it on. But honestly... That's so time consuming and it's so hard and you really don't know if it's actually going to look good. At least with this, if the flexi rod curl doesn't really look good, it's still a twist. Like it would still be a twist out. It would be probably like a loose twist out or something. But if you're doing your hair just this and then you're wrapping it around, oh baby, there's more room for fuck up. Yeah. I'm most likely going to keep this on for a little over 12 hours. Um... It is already around 8 p.m. right now. So I'm gonna keep these in probably till like 3, 4 p.m. If it doesn't feel dry, then I'm definitely keeping it in much later because I'm not taking chances. You do not want to undo a flexi rod that's still wet. That is like the worst mistake you can do. And this is the last flexi rod. <gasps> last section and the last flexi rod. I did that. I did that. When I try to venture off to other things, it never lasts because like readings is my main, I guess, fan base and focal point and all that. So it's like I can, I try to branch off to other things. Like I've recorded, edited and posted videos of mukbangs and hair tutorials. I even have like an old install video from like two years ago, me installing a wig. Um... And I haven't even uploaded that, the wig install. So if you guys actually want to see that, let me know. I did curls. I did like a half up, half down. I was 30 inches, bust down. I did a half up, half down. And then I had like one piece, like a curly bang. It was really cute. Let me know if you guys want that in the comments. Let me know, let me know. Because if you don't, I'm not going to upload it because it's from a year or two ago. But it's still informative. But yeah, you guys. So every time I try to branch off to other things, it doesn't really last. So I'm going to try and stay consistent with this. Um, so welcome to my journey of venturing off to other things and I will show you guys the takedown tomorrow Hey you guys, I am back. So it's about 1 30 the next day. So it's time to take these things down I'm hoping it's dry. I feel like it is this part right here. It came undone in the middle of my sleep So it might not be as curled as the rest, but we'll see so I'm gonna go in with the turmeric butter from heavenly Heavenly nature like I said 10 out of 10 y'all but I'm going to do a review on it, so wait for, you know, the full, the full review, but oh, I love this. It smells so good, and I want my hair to smell like it, so always, 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 whether you're taking down a twist out, flexi rods, um, freaking a braid out, always when you're undoing a style, you want to oil up your hands with some type of oil or butter. And the purpose of that, oh, you can see a little, a little ring curl. The purpose of that is so when you undo your curls or your hair, it, um, it's not even about moisture because oil, you know, can't give you moisture. See? It's like, mm. it's not even about moisture because oil can't really give you moisture. It's just about making, I don't even know how to explain it. But it's like, if you go in with your hair and it's dry, your curls is going to come out frizzy. So the oil and the butters is basically to help the curls not be frizzy. Look at that. Look at that. Y'all see that? Okay. 
Okay, it's coming together. Let's see how I'm gonna style this though, because this seems like the loose one. I don't know. Let's see how this one comes out. I feel like this one is gonna be tighter. Yep, it sure fucking is. See, and that's the issue with the flexi rods. You never know. See how this one is? So I might do like a side part and then pull this behind, you know? I'm gonna just run this butter through. Okay, so with the curls, you are going to separate it where it naturally separates. Like, you do not want any frizz. So you are going to separate it where it naturally separates. See like at the bottoms, you can sort of see it. It's parts. You're gonna separate it where it naturally curls to prevent extreme frizz. See, you wanna part it where it naturally parts. They're not terrible. I just, I don't like it. It's just not my type of curl pattern. But that's the thing with flexi rods. It's sort of like you never really know the curl pattern you're going to get. So now I'm just playing with my hair. And now I'm all dressed and I'm ready to go out. But at first I wasn't really liking it. But now that it's loosening up a bit, I actually like it. I like it a little. It actually reminds me of sister locks. Like this part right here it reminds me of locks. Like, it reminds me of Sister Locks. So I actually really, I'm digging it now. All right, thanks for watching, you guys. Make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And more videos to come, beauty videos. Like I said, I'm not going to stop with the readings. That's not what I'm going to do. I'm not going to stop with the readings. But I do want to venture off to other things. Since I was a kid, I always wanted to do, you know, hair stuff and makeup stuff. And it's like this and that. So it's like, why not now? I sort of, you know, have the subscribers. I sort of have the fan base. Why not now? Might as well. All right, bye. <laughs>